Listen to this. Well, first off, our thoughts go out to all the victims of this. We're out here tonight. Joe Pa alerted his supervisors, who one of those supervisors was the chief of all campus police. He did what he needed to do. Mike McCreary still has a job, who witnessed the actual event. He didn't call the police. Joe Pa notified who he needed to notify, and he got randomly fired over the phone after all he's done for this campus. People study in his $10 million library every week. $10 million library, and he got fired over the phone. He's been here for 62 years. So is that what it is? It's a style thing that got fired over the phone? It's that. It's the fact that he's gone. It's a shame. It's just a, it's a travesty how they did it. But everything goes out to the victims first. He maybe could have done more. He said he could have done more. I mean, what else do you want from him? So what's next for this crowd? What's next for this crowd? I mean, nothing's going too nuts here. We're all gathered in the streets. It's nothing. No one's, no one's in danger. The cops got in the eye. Show our support for Joe. Thank you. No problem. A relatively well informed fan, uh, I would say, he had some of the facts correct and was smart enough to allude to the victims first, but they do come first. It's a very interesting dichotomy.